All right, all right, all right. Hey, YouTube, I'm Lucky, and in today's video, we're going to be talking about a new perk that has arrived in Season 17. It's called Incandescent, and I think this is probably going to be one of the most sought-after perks because it obviously pairs really well with Solar 3.0, and Bungie is, of course, going to push us to use Solar 3.0 builds as they did with Void 3.0. Now, Incandescent reads, defeating a target spreads Scorch to those nearby. More powerful combatants and opposing guardians cause Scorch in a larger radius so that's a pretty cool perk and you can pair this with we'll use it on the hammer titan here so if i look at my roster real quick you can see we've got sleepy in here and credit to sleepy for showing me this um we have compare this with the soul invictus aspect and you could probably create an even crazier build with this i'm just giving you like the the building blocks of this so if you do come up with even something even crazier please feel free to tell me or comment down below um Solar ability, final blows, hammer of soul impacts, and defeating scorched targets creates sunspots. So you can actually create sunspots uh, from the weapons, from the weapon kills from the scout rifle. So keep that in mind, the incandescent. So we'll demonstrate a little bit of the power of this now. This isn't the most effective uh, clear of ads necessarily, but in certain situations you can see where the ads group up. You can just create sunspots with a scout rifle from distance, which is pretty cool. And I think this would be especially awesome on the Callus Mini Tool, which I'll pull up here in just a moment. So I'm, they're going to push up. Go ahead, and they're going to shoot their scout. See, they shoot one. They're affected by Scorch. And the third kill there creates a Sunspot. The Sunspot then chains and kills other enemies. Enemies that walk through it are damaged by it. Continues to getting kills. More Sunspots are created. So the add clear potential is obviously really, really good for this weapon, as you can see. Now... With that being said, I think this will be like the perk to have on the Callus Mini Tool because last season we had the Funnel Web. Um, SMGs are kind of like the go-to primary for ad clear right now, and primary ammo weapons are the weapon of ad clear, uh, the weapon of choice for ad clear. So we've got Incandescent as an option you can get on this when you uh, are able to craft this bad boy. You can even get the Enhanced Incandescent defeating a target spreads a longer lasting Scorch to those nearby. More powerful combatants and opposing guardians cause Scorch in a larger, larger radius. So an even more powerful version of Incandescent. So that's pretty cool. Pairing this with Threat Detector would be really cool. Or even just Unrelenting could actually be cool for just health regeneration. If you're, you know, using an SMG and ads are hitting at you and stuff could also be pretty cool. So definitely something to keep your eyes out for. If you do get a Callus Mini Tool dropped with this, definitely hang on to that bad boy. And try to spec out your Solar 3.0 build to uh, work with this because I think you'll have a lot of fun with it. That's a wrap on today's video. Make sure to subscribe if you enjoyed. Smash the like button. See you in the next one. Later.